Hello everyone, welcome to my final vlog on Pokemon Sun and Moon Ultra Legends. These will be on the last two episodes of Sun and Moon series, so let's open them up. The first part of this finale is entitled Dreaming of the Sun and Moon, we get to hear the theme song one last time. As Noggle Noggle turns to Ultra Space, everyone else is determining their plans after leaving the Pokemon Academy. Sophocles plans to go study at Mossy Space Center in Holland with his cousin Molain. And Lana will be going on a fishing voyage with her father Marlon to find Manaphy. Mana wants to keep working on new recipes for the restaurant. Before Ash goes back home, he decides to have a battle with Kiawe. One big part is Lily wants to activate Magirna, especially considered connected to her father Moon. What's to know about Ash wanting to keep improving is nothing new. Systems are going back home this time are. Mala also wants to make the restaurant for Pokemon as much as their partners. The only continues working on Magirna and its most key component, the Soul Heart. Only just when they review the Volcano movie, so let's continue. Ash and Kiawe have the battle the next day, and while Kiwi starts like, does fight bravely, he I really like the payoff his arc has. Mm. Back with Lily, Gladian comes to see his sister, and Moon Zorark is able to show the memory of Lily as a little girl. Tom was activated then. Everyone just in time's here for steps. At this moment, and Magirna awakens to find the whereabouts of Moon. Dress and Kiawe speak with Olivia as realize what he wants to do next that night. To keep traveling and improving. Plenty of need to say about journeys next, I just need to figure out when I'll say it. Now, the conclusion. Thank you, Alola. The dream continues. Who's as it's time for commencement of the Pokemon Academy, Lily has brought in Magina with plans to find her father with Gladion. Mm. Elsewhere, Team Rock has been summoned back to headquarters, and the way they're packing up their base, nice little way of acknowledging their mission is done. Likewise, when Mercury tries to attack Pikachu, it sees it on reflection in the water. However, it finally softens, recognizes Pikachu as a worthy opponent. Leaving the partners a little behind, they bid them goodbye when they're receiving his parting gift, and Beware sends them on their way. The next day, Ash meets up in the restaurant on Sokaleo's back. He tells everyone even though he's going back home, it's not the end of his journey. Rodan will also be helping to eat their paradise while Lusamine is away. I really love the whole bomb voyage that Lily gets as she sets up on the boat to find her dad with Magirna. That night, Ash taken to the airport by Queen Burnett, where they hug him for a boy in the plane shows they were more than just his host and Lola. They were like his extended family. As the plane takes off, the Ultra Guardians see Ash off. The boy heads back to Kanto and they all go their separate ways, vowing to meet again. Hmm. Yeah. Sophocles with his cousin Mole and the two touchdown and Mossy Upsetting and Hoenn begin their research. Lala leaves on a fishing expedition with her father Marlin, bound to give Mallow a print of a manaphy egg when she returns. Now comes one of the best parts of this finale. Ulu returns home to the restaurant with the bouquet of quesadilla flowers. As Shimon transforms into its sky form, the eyes have it. As she leaves, make clear that Mallow's mother, Aina, is alive, and so is her family's dream. Kiawe begins training with Olivia on the other island, Kahunas. Reformed Guzma uh, and Plumera continue to better themselves as trainers. And the final shot doesn't hide the fact that Burnett is expecting a child. Closing on the phrase, and your dreams. Hmm. It has been quite the eventful couple of years since I covering the series. I'm glad I've been able to tell you how I feel about it. I'm grateful for the opportunity to have shared this with you all, and though I'll be taking a brief hiatus from the series now that I'm done with Sun and Moon, I still intend to look at journeys in greater detail in your future. I just need to work out when and how I'll approach that. Thank you for your support over the last couple of years, and I will see you again soon. Alola. Mm.